darling, isn't it wonderful to be alone? Oh, it certainly is, honey. And what a relief not to be bothered with those laurels tonight. Now we can have a nice, quiet evening. <laughs> Nothing to mar our happiness. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Papa! <laughs> Morals. Well, what did you ask them here for tonight? I didn't ask them here tonight. I haven't seen them for two weeks. Well, you must have. They wouldn't come here uninvited. I tell you, I didn't invite them here. Don't lie to me, you big lunk. Don't you call me a lunk. Why, for two pens, I... Well, I didn't want to come in the first place. Well, wait a minute. Better leave him a note. go for a dish of ice cream. We haven't got any ice cream. Well, you could get some ice cream. Yes, dearie, you can get some ice cream. Get me my new hat, dear, and I'll get some ice cream. Pardon me, please. Yes. You're going to get it in your hat? No, I'm not going to get it in my hat. Go in the kitchen and get me a pitcher. What's that? A picture. I don't think I want any. You'll have ice cream if it's the last thing I do. Where'd he go? He went out. Well, we won't be long.
Good evening. Good evening, sir. What can I do for you, sir? We'd like a quart of your best ice cream, please. Yes, sir. What flavor? Uh, what flavors have you? Strawberry, pineapple, and vanilla. What flavor do you want? I'll have chocolate. I'm sorry, but we're out of chocolate. Have you any mustachio? No, we're out of mustachio. Get out of mustachio. Yes. He's out of mustachio. Mm-hmm. What other flavors are you out of? Strawberry. We're out of orange, gooseberry, and chocolate. All right, I'll have it without chocolate. Didn't the gentleman just tell you that he didn't have any chocolate? I just told the gentleman I didn't want Just give us a quart of any kind that's handy. Please. Yes, sir. What flavor's that? Chocolate. I just told him I didn't, he didn't have... I'm sorry, but a five's the smallest I have, sir. Thank you. your life. You've got a lot of nerve butting into other people's affairs. Well, now that you've saved me, you can take care of me. <laughs> I'm sorry, lady, but we've got a couple of wives we've got to take care of. <laughs> Good night. Good night. Just a minute there. Hey, wait a minute. Just a minute. If you make one move, I'll stop screaming. I'll tell the world that you pushed me in the water. That you tried to murder me. Oh. Ah! Well, come on, let's go home. I want to get out of these wet clothes. Where do you live? Uh, 
Over there. Oh, fine. Well, make it snappy. Come on. you let us alone? Well, for a consideration, I might. Oh, money, huh? I should say not. This has gone far enough. We'll go in and tell our wives just what happened. We'll lay our cards right on the table. We'll tell the truth about this woman. We'll come clean. Now you go in and tell them. What are you... What about you? Ah, uh, he won't go. He's only bluffing. Oh, is that so? Bluffing, huh? Well, I'll show you whether I'm bluffing or not. What happened? 
I must have told her the wrong story. Hey, are you sure it's her? Never more sure of anything in my life. Oh. There! That's her, all right! Watch the door! Okay. She's gone. $1,000. I'm going to buy a thousand dollars worth of chocolate ice cream. Where's Stanley? He's gone to the beach. <laughs> 